Hi, today we're in Malibu Creek State Park. And this beautiful shrub here, this is a coffee berry, or better known as a California coffee berry, or California buckthorn. All right, it's Frangula californica, or Frangula californica. It's got these little coffee berries here, All right? Take a look at that. So it's native to North America. It's a flowering plant in the buckthorn family. All right, it's a shrub. Grows about three to 12 feet high. There are a lot of subspecies of this plant you can find as well. Sometimes it might even uh, get like 12 feet tall or even taller. This guy here is probably about 12 feet tall. The branches, so sometimes you get a little reddish tinge on them, especially the new branches. See right here, the new stems, they got this reddish tinge right here, but the older ones, they're a little more dull as well. And the leaves here, right, they're uh, elongated. They're a tiny bit serrated on the edges, okay? They're a darker green on top and they're uh, light green on the bottom, all right? And they're pretty soft to the touch, all right? Let's see what else we find out about this uh, wonderful plant here. Uh, the leaves again. So the leaves, as they work themselves up the stem, they do alternate. So you have one here, and then it alternates up the stem until you get to the top. So this plant here flowers in May to June, and then it uh, produces these little juicy droops, or fruits. They can be green, red, or black, and they're um, just a couple centimeters long. All right. So you find this plant out in the California chaparral in the woodlands, coastal sage shrub, California oak woodlands. It likes to really grow in the foggy coastal oak areas alongside, you know, coast redwood forests or California mixed evergreen forests or even the mountain coniferous forests. Okay, and that repro reproduces uh, sexually by seed and vegetatively by sprouting. And it's really a, quite a dominant species in a lot of our areas here. In the absence of wildfire, right, this guy can grow pretty tall. But if there is a fire, it uh, just resprouts real quickly from the surviving root crown. Now the parts of this plant are the fruit, right? It's eaten by mule deer, black bears, lots of birds. They like this little coffee berry fruit. I'm not sure it's uh, quite edible for humans. These aren't quite ripe yet. There you go. This is our uh, California coffee berry. How about that? It's a great looking shrub. Thanks for watching my video. Have a great day. Bye.